And it's Friday, so it's time to find out the latest in sports with Sonny Young from the Sunny Side of Sports. Hello, sports fans. I'm VOA Sonny Young with the Sunny Side of Sports. Let's give a Sunny Side of Sports salute to the Spanish club Barcelona, which dethroned Manchester United in the UEFA Cup final in Rome. Security was very tight in the Italian capital, and security preparations are underway in South Africa, the venue for next month's FIFA Confederations Cup tournament. The eight-nation event kicks off June 14th in Johannesburg, and it's billed as a dress rehearsal for the 2010 World Cup, which South Africa will also host. Turning to tennis, early round action is continuing at the French Open in Paris where Spanish star Rafael Nadal is bidding for a record fifth consecutive title on the clay courts at Roland Garros. In motorsports, there were thrills and spills, both on the track and in the pits at the annual Indy 500 race, described as the grand spectacle of auto racing here in the USA. Brazilian driver Elio Castroneves celebrated his third Indy 500 title. Also in the USA at the Los Angeles Marathon, Kenyan athlete Wesley Career celebrated his biggest and most lucrative victory. Career won a new car as well as prize money and bonuses totaling $160,000. He set a course record of two hours, eight minutes and 24 seconds. Finally, in Gloucestershire, England, it wasn't a foot race, it wasn't an auto race, but a cheese rolling race down Cooper's Hill. About 200 competitors took part in this cheesy event, risking broken bones down the notoriously steep slope. Let's give a sunny side of sports salute to the big cheese, Chris Anderson, who won for a fifth year in a row. I'm VOA Sonny Young, and that's the sunny side of sports. Thank you very much, Sonny. Uh, watch for Sunny Side of Sports each Friday on In Focus.